Assalamu alaikum. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, we will learn about shear plate connection or fin plate connection. These are the details of shear plate connection. Let's start. First step grid modification. Double click on grids. In X coordinate, 20 feet. In Y coordinate, type 15 feet and in Z coordinate 16 feet. Now labels for X 1, 2 and for Y A, P and for Z plus 0 plus 16. Click on modify. Right click to the mouse. Fit area work entire model. Close properties. Now Second step, create views along grid lines. Select grids. Click on create views along grid lines. Click on create, OK and close. Now, column placing. Column rotation, top. In design drawing, we have W8 into 35 column. Select W8 into 35. Top. 16 feet bottom elevation 0 placed on grid A1 and grid A2. Now for beam placing, open view list, open planet elevation 16 feet, we have W12 into 40 beam. In steel option, select beam, double click on beam, change its profile to W12 into 40. Place it from left to right. Midpoint of the column to another midpoint of the column. Or intersection point of grid to another intersection point of grids. Now open application and component type shear. Select 186 connection number macro. Select column and then beam. It will take few seconds to load. Default connection is applied. Now double click on macro to open and edit. First let's change plate position. In plate change its position. Ok. Now gap between beam Two column flange is half inch. Plate thickness half inch. P one material for plate. A36 in steel option select A36 name shear plate now in stiffeners we don't have any stiffeners at column location select column without stiffener now in bolts in our design drawing, we have 13 by 16 holes, number of bolts 3, bolt size select 3 by 4, tolerance 1 by 16, bolt standard A325N, beam top to the first bolt, distance 3 inch.
beam and to the first bolt is 1 inch 1 by 2 plate edge distance 1 inch 1 by 2 at both the end number of bolts is 3 and bolt to bolt distance is also 3 inch plate edge distance 1 inch 1 by 2 now type 0 in slotted holes click on modify there is no chamfer in our design information click on plates select plate without chamfer click on modify ok now only remaining is to provide weld as per our design information in our design information we have 5 by 16 weld at far side and near side click on weld option see the picture type 5 by 16 fillet weld near side far side click on modify and ok turn on parts in components to check the weld double click on weld to open properties check size ok right side turn on component option double click on macro click on apply ok now select 186 macro select column and then beam done we have completed our connection as per our design information thanks for watching